Please, sign here. This document will be effective immediately upon signing, and you two may exit the Fortress of Meripede via the regular channels. It's been so long since we've been to the surface! Let's hurry up and- ah! uh, What's happening? <sighs> I'm fine, thanks. But I wonder what that tremor was just now. On the gale. <sighs> Quit following me. Good to see you two. Is there something you wish to see me about? Yeah! What was with that earthquake just now? Ah, that. The tremor didn't originate from the seafloor. In fact, it seems it came from the surface. Over the years of serving as the warden here, I have developed a sense for distinguishing between what occurs on the surface and what occurs underwater. Besides, the seal that Monsieur Neuvillette set in place won't fail so easily. So, the fortress is okay? If you recall our last incident, if there really were a problem, there would be crowds of inmates in a panic right now. Huh. You've got a point. Okay, seems we need to get back up to the surface and ask about what happened. Uh, by the way, do you know what day it is today? Hmm, I believe today is this month's pipe cleaning day. Wait, seriously? Ah, yes. Have you completed your release papers? Yep. Uh, it's you two. Uh, are you leaving now? That's right! Today is our last day in prison! But now that Paimon says that, it doesn't feel like we were confined here. It's actually been pretty nice! Oh yeah, Paimon feels fond of this place now! Well, then be sure to come back and visit. I'll miss you. If you've signed the release papers, then you're free to go. The guards will escort you out. You're not going to see us off? <laughs> I knew you'd ask. All right, sure. Let's go. Well, you actually agreed. Uh, no worries, you must be busy. Paimon was just joking. Ah, so you do have a polite side, I see. <laughs> After being down here for so long, 
I imagine you must feel like you're lacking companionship. Shall I come along too? Yeah, don't worry, we'll come back to see you. Uh, Paimon really likes the cafeteria here. The chefs sure do know how to make good grub! I hope you won't be here as convicts the next time I see you. We'll do our best to stay out of trouble! Well, it seems our work in the Fortress of Meravine is finished! That's the end of another chapter in our journey! And since Nervalev was the one who asked us to come here, we should probably go report to him now. Next up, the Palais Marmonia! You're going to see Monsieur Nervilet? <laughs> Please pass on our kind regards. I'm sure just your regards will do, no? Hmm, I believe it would be the polite thing to do. You're right. I've heard the Palais has been terribly busy these days. Tell him that I hope he hasn't been overwhelmed by the recent string of troubles. If you're concerned about things at the Palais, why don't you take some time to go up and check things out? I believe you should still have some vacation time to spend. <sighs> Thank you for being so understanding. It means a lot. It's been some time since I've gone to the surface. <sighs> I must say that I've started to miss it a little. Harmonia sure is buzzing with activity today! Halt! Huh? Oh, uh, it's you two. <laughs> Apologies. Monsieur Nirvillette did say you'd be welcome at any time. Excuse me, uh, would you mind helping me take a look at this report? I'll be right there. Sorry, I've got my hands full here. You can see yourselves in. Seems a lot has been happening. Nivellet! Hello. You've come at the right time, but you'll have to wait for just a moment, as there are some urgent matters I must tend to first. In the meantime, please, have a seat. If you'd like to have something to drink, let the Melusine outside know. Very well, then. Let's take a break over there while we wait for him to finish his work. <laughs> All right. I should wrap things up for now. Are you done with your work? Yes, sorry to keep you waiting. Today should be the day you were released from the Fortress of Meripede. And it appears that you've managed to complete all the release paperwork. That's right! And we came here to see you right away! Hmm... A massive whale... Do you have any idea what that might be? Judging from your description, that cannot have occurred in any ordinary waters, but rather something like the Primordial Sea. A whale of that size and shape cannot usually be found in the waters of Tivat. Therefore, we can only assume that Child is presently immersed in primordial seawater. Immersed in primordial seawater? But how? Is he okay? 
Most people wouldn't be capable of entering in the first place. I'm not completely sure how he could have gotten there myself. Yes? What is it? Ah, oh, right! Paimon felt it too! We asked the Duke and he said it wasn't from underwater, so we figured you might know something about it! It turns out that I have just received a report about this particular matter. In fact, that's exactly what I was busy with a moment ago. The source of the tremor was here on the surface near Poisson. After the shaking stopped, the water levels in the Poisson area rose at an alarming rate. The water levels rose? Oh no! What about all the people there? Fortunately, the water levels only rose for a short period of time and have already returned to normal now. However, I still have a bad feeling about the whole phenomenon. If the change in water levels is connected with the leaking primordial seawater, then the situation in Poisson may be much worse than it appears. Navia should be in Poisson, right? We need to go check on her! I would also like to go there as soon as possible, but I'm afraid I can't leave just yet. We must immediately formulate disaster prevention plans for the surrounding coastal areas to avoid potential catastrophes. I'll have to ask you two to go to Poisson first. I'll meet you there to check on the situation once I finish things here. There's no time to lose! Let's get going! Please be careful. The two of you have my thanks. If you need any help, just let me know. The wind rises. Swan Fury. your balance uh, all right just hurry <sighs> I'm not young anymore how will I survive on my own <laughs> my Desiree oh, he looks pretty sad my leg! My leg! How could this have happened? It hurts! <laughs> <laughs> 
Just hang in there. Help is on the way. You can hold my hand if it makes you feel better. Just hang it. You're here. We heard there was a situation in Poisson, so we came as quickly as we could. Yes. As you can see, the water level suddenly rose. It caused quite the disturbance, in fact. Demoiselle! There was a wounded resident next to a building southeast of here. We've already transported him to safety, but we've run out of medical supplies. He's wounded? How badly? He fell, so it's probably a broken leg. He's pretty shaken up. When the water level rose, he desperately climbed up to the roof. Once the water receded and he saw the ground, he became terrified and eventually... He jumped down then. Find the leader of Squad 1 and tell him to take the wounded resident to see a doctor. He should know where to go. Understood. I'll take over his search and rescue mission in the meantime. All right. You'll be in charge. I'm sorry. Where were we? Uh, the situation in Poisson? Ah, uh, right. Allow me to explain. A little earlier, we suddenly heard a loud noise. At first, everyone thought that something might have exploded in the waterways. But before we knew it, water started pouring out from everywhere. The rushing water seemed a little odd, almost like the unique color of primordial seawater. Some people didn't realize the danger and thought it was just ordinary water, leaking from somewhere. Everyone on the street who happened to be close to the water didn't have a chance to escape. As the water levels rose, they suddenly disappeared. They were all dissolved. Those who realized what was happening started to flee in a panic, desperately trying to get to higher ground. Many were injured in the stampede, and some... some people fell from significant heights. The Spina di Rosula initiated rescue operations as quickly as possible, but there have been... a lot of casualties. Fortunately... The water began to recede after some time, and the chaos came to an end. The water that flooded the area contained primordial seawater, so the lower levels of Poisson are still hazardous. To ensure everyone's safety, I've asked the people there to leave as soon as possible. No one knows if this could happen again. All we can do for now is try our best to help evacuate the residents. We still haven't completed the headcount, but... We'll have some numbers soon. How awful. And all of this just came out of nowhere. It was quite frightening indeed. <laughs> I only wish that everything that just happened was a bad dream. Is there any way we can help, Navia? Thank you for being so willing to help in a moment of crisis like this. You don't know how much it means to me. I really... Uh, can't...
can't express how grateful I am. Don't say that, Navia. That's what friends are for. <sighs> Demoiselle, we've got a situation here. Uh, I'll be right there. Sorry, I, I need to go for now. <laughs> <laughs>